Seattle-Tyler Lockett had a steady stream of visitors on the Seahawks bench, coach Pete Carroll, DK Metcalf, Quandre Diggs, all reminding the standout wide receiver had get another chance after two uncharacteristic mistakes. The opportunity emerged, and Lockett seized it, securing a 33-yard touchdown catch that provided the decisive points in Seattle's 27-13 win over the New York Giants on Sunday. Lockett hauled in the pass from Geno Smith with 9-18 left that snapped a 13-13 tie. Kenneth Walker 3 added a 16-yard touchdown run in the closing minutes and Seattle walked away with a third straight victory. I had a lot of teammates behind me, talking to me. Pete was able to come talk to me, and I just had to breathe, Lockett said. That was the biggest thing and luckily I had the opportunity just to be able to go out there and to be able to overcome it just with another play. The only matchup of teams with winning records in the NFL this week was a slugfest until the fourth quarter, when Lockett made up for his earlier miscues and Walker finally broke free, helping the surprising Seahawks, 5-3, stay atop the NFC West. New York, 6-2, saw its four-game win streak snapped entering its bye week and lost ground to undefeated Philadelphia in the NFC East, largely because the Seahawks corralled Saquon Barkley, who was held to a season-low 53 yards on 20 carries and had three catches for nine yards. I thought they did a G. I think we averaged less than three yards. I thought they did a good job on the perimeter. We didn't hit any big plays off of them. They just did a better job than we did, Giants coach Brian Dable said. Lockett hauled in a short pass at the three-yard line in the first half, but Adoree Jackson forced and recovered a fumble, leading to a one-yard TD run from Barkley. Late in the third quarter, Lockett was free behind the Giants secondary but dropped what would have been a 33-yard touchdown. Given another chance on Seattle's next drive, Lockett came through. First he made a solid 12-yard catch. Then he made a stutter and go move on Jackson and flashed open down the sideline. Smith's throw was on target for the touchdown and a 20-13 Seattle lead. I was giving him a different route and Tyler noticed that the DB was sitting, he was squatting, Smith said. He signaled me one of our double moves, so I gave it to him and he went out there and he made a great play. Seattle added insurance with 5.22 left thanks to Walker, 